Hello there, I'm John Grodel with more Super Mario Galaxy. In the last part, we got, I think, one star, and then we had we had trouble with this star, which is like, choose a favorite snack, or something, is what it's called. It's in Sandville Galaxy, I think. That's what it's called. I know it's Sand something, but it's a Hungry Uma Star Machine. You have to pay a thousand star bits to get this galaxy unlocked. It's only one star, like these, like it always is, kind of, with these Hungry Umas. Yeah, choosing a favorite snack is this star machine name. I have eight lives. Um, I hope I don't get another game over. Like, I've had like three game over accounts, all because it's one star, and that's really, you know, really just putting me down. And I'm pretty upset about it. But hopefully, in this recording session, at least I'll get the star. I think I got it this time. I mean, with all the, with all that trial and error we had in the last part, yeah. Hopefully, we'll learn from the best. We'll, we'll learn for the best for it. And I ran. I ran right into that. Okay, I'm gonna actually try it. I've never tried the BC one, because I always did the Boom Wire one. So we'll see what happens. So I won't get affected by a light, but I have like eliminated time to fly and stuff. Okay, that was close. Okay, um. I don't know if you can hear it, but dogs are broken. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna snag this coin here. Grab back on the pole. Um, so far so good, I guess. I didn't time that out well. Can I fly all the sand if that happens? I don't think you can fly all the sand if that happens. I'm gonna try one more with B suit, and then if not, if I fail again, then I'll just do the um, boom wire or boo room. And oh my gosh, yeah. Because I know I can do it with the boom wire. I just want to show both the ways. Just so, in case you guys are wondering what it looks like. Even this game came out in 2007, which was roughly 7 years ago. Let's just, you know, disregard that for a second. How am I supposed to... I lost it. Okay, um, what are my options here? I can either just stand this pull all day. Oh, wait, I have another option to boot. Yeah, I guess I'll say if you don't, um, oh my gosh, you're kidding me. I guess I'll say if you, like, mess up and lose your beam or your mushroom or whatever, you power up. And if you, and if a boo freaking kisses you, you fall, you just turn back into Mario from being boo Mario, because it's attracted you when you're boo Mario. It all makes sense now. Yay. If you can move out of the way, that'd be great. I know I can do this with the beast room, so I'm gonna give it one more shot because I'm like that. And thank you, I actually ran into it. Oh no, no, no! That was cheap. It freaking—that's the effect when you get burned. You freaking run off. I gotta really—I gotta get my head in the game. I gotta really put my game or my head in my Nintendo Wii. That's how you get your head in the game, people. Get, oh my gosh! I'm not. I've had some bad luck with this LP lately. <laughs> I've had some really bad luck with this. I'm just, go with the boom, I'm just gonna go with the boom wire thing, or boom wire shroom. Oh my goodness. Seriously, you, t you don't have to be this mean to me. Okay, um, if I get hit one more time, I die. If I, if I get hit by that, I die. It's not gonna hit me or anything cool. The hammock's not gonna use magic. Good thing I can go back. I'd be careful, guys. Hey, yeah, fell, it's okay. Now, we just gonna be cheap and fly all the way up to the top. Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. Thank you, okay. Now we have to be cheap and fly all the way to the top like this. Okay. We got it. We made it. Okay, now we got checkpoints. That's nice. So now, I think I'm going to do, I'm going to long jump to get to this little... Gaps have to jump. I'm doing. Sick. I'm not doing a too good job about this. A good job about it. Thank you. Okay, now I can start. It's gonna be off really soon, though. Don't hit me, darling. Don't hit me, mines. Mines, don't hit me. How am I supposed to get the rainbow star? Oh, maybe I'll be. Yes, got it. Nice. 
Going around just to be safe. I wonder if I can long jump into that. Yes, I can. It's awesome. I actually got it. Now I actually got it. Star power. I can long jump into it when it's close enough. That makes total sense because of the gravitational pull. Yeah, we got that star. I'm done with it. That star cost me three game overs when it was that simple. When I got to that point with the different color flowing, I could have just long jumped to the moon and get the star that way. But I thought I made that way too hard. I made that look way harder than it actually is. Anyway, we got done. We, we're done with that star. I'm glad we are, and that rhymed, and I didn't mean it to. I didn't mean for it to rhyme. So now we can go back into the one of the where we were at. So let me just cut to where that is, and I'll see you guys in a second. Here we are, and um, this observatory is the engine. Oh, it's the engine room. It's not observatory, but it kind of is. But it's called the engine room, I guess. Okay, engine room, observatory. There we go. So, see Slide Galaxy, we have one more star still there working around. So let's just get it. It's a new star, the Silver Stars of Sea Slide. Okay, this is a Silver Star mission. We probably have to collect a lot of them. At least, maybe just five, like we've done in the past with these kind of missions. Missions? Yeah, okay, let's just, let's go. Oh, we can't skip the cutscene, because... It's the first time going into the star mission. So I saw one on the treetop, I think. Yeah, there's one that you can see in the cutscene. And there's one right there. So we got some hunting to do. And I see one on top of the rocky arch thing. Yeah, so it's going to be called rocky arch thing. Oh, wait, we need that bee mushroom because we have to get on that cloud that I see right there. No way we can do that is get the bee mushroom. Interesting. We don't need, we need, we need that shell for a short amount of time. Just to make it a little quicker. Nice, this is just as an easy platform, because you can't make it all the way to one go, because then you run out of flying time. So one star, out of the way, okay. Um, so I'm looking around here. If, the stars fall you, which is pretty cool too. There's one on the tree, let's go with the big one and get that one out of the way, the one on the treetop. And then again, if you touch the water with b Mario, then you're just going to fall. So I'm going to keep my b Mario seat as long as I can, actually. Is so one hidden in here? No, oh, no, it's not. Okay. So, this is kind of just a simple mission, but I could struggle with it. I don't really see how you can really die much in this star mission, but you could, I guess, die. Because you can die in all star missions, of course. Yeah. Can we grab this? Yeah, we're doing pretty well if I don't say so myself. Oh, there's a spider that... No, I, I had to say that. I was doing fairly decent. And then that happened when I wasn't paying attention. Gee. Okay, so what can we do as an alternative? Because I don't want to go all the way back for the Let's see here. Okay. I think you need the B-minus. B-minus. Oh, or you can use that to... I didn't I didn't like it swim out of the stage like that, but it kind of makes sense because this is circular. I have to go back and get that. I have to go back and get the shelf for a second. Oh man, this is just rough. I want to go up. I want to go up. There we go. No, that no. I didn't mean to do that. That's such stupid. That is a stupid concept right there. Jumping out and then you're flying off the stage. Galaxy planet, whatever it is. Get pl yeah, galaxy. So yeah, you can die in this star mission a lot if you're like me, who fa who's fa who f who um fails at everything. Yeah. No, you no 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 stop stop! I don't want you. To die. It's really not that hard as it looks, but apparently I'm having a really bad trouble with it. You know, I'm starting to hate this mission. Even though it's really just simple. What? I was right there. No, are you freaking kidding me? Are you kidding me? I died there too. Am I gonna get a game over in this freaking part? I don't want to get a game over in this freaking part. I already have like 12 game over counts. 
It's really not that hard, but it's just screwing me over. The world things that screw me over is really just what happens. Screw the show right now. I just want to get my beat Mario, the beat shroom. Can you even, can you walk there? Yes, you can't. Gosh dang it. Don't freaking swim through the freaking rest of the world. That would suck. Oh my gosh. Getting on top of the tree would help. But I was a freaking on it. Are you kidding me? Seriously, game. Seriously. Just screaming over every single time. Okay, there we go. See, that's what I did the first time around. That one made a whole lot more sense. Thank you, finally got the first single star now. Yay. Start over here. Stop it. Hmm, interesting. Maybe out here. Oh, yeah, this is this looks easy. Ah, oh, spiders, of course. I, I, I don't, oh man, you get, I'll, I'll wipe for the spiders to come back with another, um, be Mario, or be Shroom. There we go, I hit it actually. This much trouble with spiders. Can't even see. Okay, there we go. There we go. That was really that hard. <laughs> okay. So, um, I slowly descend real quickly. That's not good. That's not good. Oh my gosh. Can't even get out. Thank you. Okay. Um. Let's just do. Get on it. Okay, that's a path. Way. Hmm. Always still leads me all the way back here. I'm gonna cut to where I actually am supposed to be. Okay, right back up here. I'm gonna see if we can fly to the top now. There we go, there's a silver star. Okay, now, where do we go for the next one? Interesting. There's a third one, but where's the other ones? Hmm. We'll come back here later. Let's 
go all the way over there, see what's on above over there. Okay, how do we do this over here? Nice, the same thing actually. Twenty-six, of course, at twenty-six. Here, I'm just gonna use the cannon. Jeez, um, guess who launched that uh, swing star right there? Okay, that was not what I was supposed to do. Um, I think there's pole stars up there. go. There we go. So there's three. There's only one star up there. I thought there was two. Let's keep on going then. Okay, I guess there's just one. So I know I'm missing one because I still see one on the hill, which is of course the fourth one or fifth one. But I can't find the other one. Interesting. Oh, it's over there. Okay. That makes sense. There for a second. How to set? There we go. Nice. Yeah, what up? I can't get it, I can't get it, I can't get it. Okay, thank you. Okay, and we got another power star, right there. And of course it's all the way over there. Oh, thank you, <laughs> you put a launch star there. Let's talk to you, Elder Penguin, the first. There's all kinds of hubbub in Seaside. What's going on? I don't know, maybe... A giant oversized dragon, some Koopa, spiked Koopa, um... Things like that. And then we check this one, all the way over there. There we go, okay, and without getting hit, we grab the star. Okay, so, um, star power. Okay, 
long slam I should. Time battle scene. Interesting. Okay, so I'll cut the I'll call quits for this episode apart. So this has been John Kogan. I'd like to th thank you all for watching again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Super Mario Galaxy Let's Play. And in the next part, we will take on Toy Time Galaxy. So I'll see you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching this been John Kogan. I'd like to thank you for watching again. Goodbye. I hope to see you guys next. I hope to see you guys next for my Super Mario Galaxy.